Hey guys, today we're back on the Warlock refining the Meme Beam build. If you didn't see the last video, I'll do a quick recap on the spell and perk setup here. We take Soul Collector to do double the damage on Ray of Darkness with all 10 stacks, and we also take Dark Enhancement for another free 10%. And what really ties this build all together is Dark Reflection, since it scales 100% with our magic power and benefits from both Dark Enhancement and our Soul Collector stacks. We try and bait people into swinging on us while we beam them since the stacks from Soul Collector are not consumed until after the beam ends and we can always phantomize and reset using the Hydra life drain combo. Chances are the enemy will be very low at that point and will also want to reset. One thing I didn't mention last time is that magical damage is what affects the life drain healing, not any magical healing you have from your gear. But counterintuitively it does actually get the 20% bonus from vampirism. I got a couple comments asking about that last time so I thought I'd explain that here. And yes, you could run the Demon Armor perk to increase the Ray of Darkness cast time, but I just prefer the movement speed and the ability to cast the other spells faster over the PDR personally. If you want a more general overview of the build, then make sure to check out the previous Warlock video on my channel. Link will be in the top right of the video right now. And with that all out of the way, I'll let the intro roll and I hope you enjoy this one. God, fucking nuked him. Please, bro, he brought the cavalry. Watch out, bro. Hello. Ooh, piece of candy.
He died. Thank <laughs> you. 
get him. Oh. Holy shit, my hider hurts. He fucked up. He should have left. Oh, he died. Nice. Oh, this guy hurt.
Oh. I'm sorry, buddy. <laughs> 